South Australian public school students are facing another round of compulsory standardised testing. The government says the online exams in reading comprehension and maths are a low stress test that will instantly gauge performance. Students in years 3 to 10 will sit the progressive achievement tests next month. This is an annual test which gives instant feedback to the teacher about how students are going. That's one of the key differences to NAPLAN. The tests, which were developed by the Australian Council for Education Research, are taken online at a time that fits into the school schedule and there's no agonising wait for the results. The government says the marks can't be used to rank students or schools in league tables. It's a way of making sure that the teachers have that feedback that they can immediately build into how they teach that individual child, detecting any weaknesses and building on strengths. One expert says the real test will be how teachers use the results. For a teacher who has a, a very busy week and they have lots of different things happening, it's knowing which pieces of this test they can use, because sometimes it can be too detailed and sometimes it's the opposite. The teachers' union supports the test to a limit. There is a problem if you have too many tests, because then what, ha what happens is that the children's time, rather than learning, is spent in doing the tests. It's a low-level, uh, low-stress test. It's done, it's over, the teachers use it. Another controversy over SACE's Year 12 research projects appears to have subsided. As long as you pick a subject you enjoy, it's really good and it's something you want to learn more about. Students are this week attending a showcase of finished projects at the showgrounds. Tom Fedorovich, ABC News, Adelaide.